Hey y'all, it's Nasira. I can't really talk um, loud because I lost my voice and it hurts to talk. But, but um, I'm doing good. This is my f uh, day one post op. So I did. I had surgery uh, yesterday. Um, so I guess you would call it today day one post op. I don't think yesterday really counted for anything. Um, I've been walking. Socks are a little dirty. I didn't want to wear my house shoes. I just wore the socks because they gripped the floor really good. Um, I was really, really, really sick last night. Um, I was questioning myself, why did I do this? It was bad. Every time I would eat or drink something, I would throw it up. I couldn't get comfortable. Um, my gas was coming out, but it still was, it still was painful. As you can see, I look crazy as hell. And I don't like pain, so I'm thinking like, wow, do I really want to get plastic surgery in the future? Because if it's anything like this, it, the recovery is always the hardest for me. I don't like the recovery part. The surgery itself is never the problem. It's the recovery that's hard. Some people think recovery is easy, but I don't. Um, they've been giving me a lot of medicine, hydrocodone, um, Tylenol, um, morphine. I didn't want the morphine because I react funny with it, but I did try low doses yesterday because I was in so much pain. Right now, my pain level is at a S. Seven. But my dizziness is at a nine. I'm very, very dizzy. I have one of these bags. I'm not going to pick up this, the one that got a lot of spit in it, but these bags right here for spitting. Um, I'm going to turn the camera. This is the thing I use to breathe. Breathe in. These are my waters. Um, and there's one behind it over there it's brown that's for the shakes which the shakes are that's the water that i've already drunk but these are the two shakes that i have to drink in order to get up out of here you have to fill this out in order to get up out of here I would say you have to circle this. Uh, I have to go over this and it's just like stage one, stage two. It's just a follow-up sheet you have to go through. Um, but I'm moving really slow. It started at 5 a.m. It ends at 9. I don't know if I'm going to stay another day or not. Um, I'm moving really slow on my protein. This first cup that I was drinking, I just finished that this morning. And they gave that to me at 5 o'clock. So I just now finished that. Then I just now finished the second one. I'm on the third one. So... And I don't even want to do that. I'm just doing it because I have to. I don't want to do it, though. Because every time I do it, it goes down. It feels really weird. Um, makes me want to burp. And just, ugh, it's bad. Um, they gave me some antibiotics. Uh, stuff for muscle um, cramps, spasms. So, because I was having a lot of those in my tummy. I got my heating blanket. I'm gonna actually put it on my back. I really don't need it on my stomach. I do need it on my back. I had 
the TV on. I don't know if the nurse turned it off or what. I usually sleep with the TV on, but today I didn't want to. I just slept and had the door shut and everything. Um, they have not shut my door, so I'm gonna get up and shut it because it's making my room extremely, extremely cold. My sister did not show up. She got into a car accident, unfortunately. My grandma told me that this morning. My niece got sick. Uh, they said she got an ear infection, sore throat, coughing from getting in and out of that pool. That's what they say, I don't know. And um, it's just been, it's been crazy. I don't know if I'm gonna be released today. I really don't want to. But if I am, then I am. If I'm not, I'm not. I know she said something about, I will get out of here a little bit later than most people if I do go home because it's taken me forever to do this. Um, but okay, that's it. I'm gonna try to get some rest. I'm a little sleepy. As you can see, I look like shit. Um, I'm gonna have to show you guys my stomach without showing too much. There's one. There's another right there. And there's another. And I think there's one more. Oh God. I think there's one more over there or something like that. I had one right here and there's different spots I had because I got my gallbladder out when the first time I had gastric sleeve and my gallbladder freshly out. The surgeon who did me today, yesterday, Dr. Dutton, she took my gallbladder out. So there are some spots that she did not go back and open like that one, that one, that one. She created new spots. So. who had to release my tummy on these underwear because I had I had a my cycle was going but my cycle is not going anymore so that's good uh, I, I look it's a little spotting but not much to talk about um all right you guys well that's it um if you have any questions for me just leave them down there all right you guys I'll see y'all later bye